I did survive from Scrappy Mania and today I'm going to create a layout. It's a single page layout. For inspiration I'm using this sketch that I found on Pinterest and it has three pictures on portrait mode and these are some pictures that was taken when my grandniece came over to visit me here in Arizona and I want to go ahead and scrap these on in my book. So these papers are from the Webster's Pages warehouse sale and I purchased these some time ago and I do have a video of everything that came in the kit and I'll put the link on the bottom if you're interested to see what's in here. But these are these warehouse sales that Webster Pages um, sponsors every once in a while. There are um, papers that I believe are going to get discontinued or they're trying to just to clean out their warehouse. So you get a lot of stuff for um, very low price. It was about $25. So if you if you see those that um, those warehouse sales from Western Pages, they're worth purchasing in my opinion. Now here I cut everything down to um, squares. So I have the 12 by 12 cream color paper. Then I the red paper is actually 10 by 10 and then I went two inches smaller than that. 8 by 8 is the blue paper. So everything looks very symmetrical. And right now I'm kind of figuring out what strip I want to use for the top. And also I need a scallop for the bottom of my page, my um, pictures. So I decided on those two um, strips and I already put everything together. Uh, the video kind of cut off when I was putting everything together. But as you can see, I have my papers um, place my strip. I put two buttons on top and I've been cutting out little pieces out of the those the whole um, paper pad to be my embellishments. I'm using the stickers and I'm putting a sticker on the bottom on the right just to balance out the layout because as you can see I have a lot of heaviness on the top left and then on the bottom left I also am putting a little cluster so that's making my page kind of you know left side heavy so to balance it out I went ahead and put one little sticker on the right bottom part portion of my layout and then it needed something so I outlined the whole page and I outlined it my strips and it's pretty easy this was done so I hope you like this layout. It was very simple, especially when everything coordinates and you have cut aparts and everything on in your packet. It's very easy to do. So thank you for watching. Bye now.